for coming back to join us in learning more about the ProCharge desktop payment application. This how-to video in the series will cover the last major function within the ProCharge desktop payment application, processing refunds. A few small differences in the process compared to processing voids, and we will take the time to review those differences with you now. In order to process a refund, you will need two pieces of information, an invoice number and a dollar amount for the transaction being refunded. This information can be found within the ProCharge Desktop Payments CSV stored within the Workstations Documents folder, or as seen on screen, you can easily obtain this information from the receipt copy for the transaction in question. We will be refunding this transaction shortly. Unlike a void, refunds can be processed against a closed batch of transactions. However, refunds do require a physical card present or at least a full card number in order to successfully process a refund using the ProCharge desktop payment application. If you find that you need a full card number, have the authorized contact on the account reach out to our merchant support team. Someone should be able to assist in providing this information as needed. On the left, you will see the ProCharge desktop application, and on the right, you will see a video of the ProCharge desktop payment device, the PAX S300. The first step in processing a refund is selecting the refund button. This is located to the left of the sales button within the ProCharge desktop payment application. Referencing the data found in either the payments CSV or from the original transaction receipt, enter the invoice number and the amount of the refund to be issued. The negative sign will appear by default when processing a refund. Select the process button and the ProCharge desktop payment device will prompt for entry of a card. If the card is present, it can be inserted into the payment device. If not, the card number can be keyed into the payment device, the PAX S300. Once the refund has successfully processed, the ProCharge desktop payment application and payment device will prompt both the user and client of a successful refund. The user can obtain a receipt copy from the Windows Print Manager. This receipt copy can be saved and emailed at the customer's request. Here is a copy of the refund receipt, clearly indicating the refunded status. If you find that you need help processing refunds using the ProCharge desktop payment application, please feel free to contact our class leading technical support department. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for some more great content coming your way.